Good morning everybody and today's morning has finally started in the apartment that we are renting out. We already set up the feeders, the cats are chilling out. Not bad, chilling out, chilling out. I actually didn't have time to post out a video yesterday and I won't have internet in the apartment for the two days so hopefully I'll figure out a way to post out videos and stuff like that. So. Right now we need to go and get ourselves some face ID done so we could use the elevator and um, yeah, get inside the building ourselves. So guys, I just got my face ID in this place. Let's see if it works. Oh wow, verified. You could even see me here in the picture. So in this apartment complex that we're staying in, even to go in the elevator, you need to have a registered face. So not everybody could go in the elevators and I'll show you that in a second. So I have to show my face. It's verified and we're going to the top floor to check out what they got up there. Well, we already did check out, we got Evelina right here. We already got everything checked out, but we just wanna go by ourselves. Look at the photo that Evelina has. <laughs> this is funny, anyways. We're going up 14th floor, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. This is a very fast elevator. Wow, unbelievable what sort of a view we have up from the top floor, the 43rd floor of the complex. Unbelievable. We are so high up right now. This is great. And you know, it's not too hot because of the wind. It just feels absolutely amazing. Funny thing is, I think, I'm actually not sure, but you could swim here. It's like a little swimming pool. It doesn't really look like it, but I don't think it's a good idea to swim here. You just chill out and enjoy yourself. Well, 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 guys, it has become nighttime and we have arrived at the Terreparazit. I think that's what it's called night market where they sell a lot of stuff now i need to get myself some slides because the ones i'm wearing right now they are literally destroying my feet you could see my foot is red so i gotta get some other ones so that i could be walking around without damaging my feet every step i take so let's check out the market so the hardest part is we need to find where the heck are the slides at for sale but there's definitely a lot of stuff like Crocs look alike. Anything you need. Oh, even the stuff you can put on your Crocs as well. Evelina said I need those pink ones. But yeah, there's a lot and a lot of things for sale here. You know, if you need some Gucci, North Face, it's all right here. Jordan, Calvin Klein, Ralph Lauren Prada, Dior. A lot of those Gucci slides and some amazing slides right here as well. Wow. Oh, this looks like a shop I need to go in. We just need to go around. Pretty cool gangster shop right here. Oh, here's the slipper shop. Let's see which ones I need. Oh, look at this night market. Tons and tons of people walking around shopping for goods. And I need some slippers and I can't find any. All selling clothes. <laughs> Look at this dog. And it has a small uh, fan right there for the dog as well. <laughs> oh, all sorts of stuff here. You got bras, you got t shirts. All of this is very cheap as well. Some tie bags some milk tea some phone cases you got all of it here even some watches but if you want to be swagged out you could be wearing some watches omega i swear legit wow so many watches here even apple watches wow look at this even if you want to look cool there's a Rolex watch for you, so you could stand out. Some Adam R. Piquets, <laughs> some Richard Mills, anything you need. Why pay $300,000 for this if you could buy it for 
probably like 50 bucks. We had to get Evelina a fan so that she can cool herself down because she finds it very, very hot. I don't know guys, but I, I actually don't mind the heat at all whatsoever. Like it's hot, 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 but it's fine. I think I got used to it very quickly. This is like my type of weather. So I'd fit into Florida like a glove, like an absolute leather glove that fits right into the hand. You know what? That actually sounds a bit weird now. I'm gonna stop right here. You might be wondering, why do they have night markets in Thailand? Well, because during the daytime, it is very hard to go outside and do anything. So they do all their business at nighttime. Well, look, there's an electronic store behind me. Anyways, everything is done at night here. All the food, the shopping, when the heat goes down a little. But I'll tell you one thing, it's still hot at nighttime here. Very hot and humid. I think we actually came at the most humid time that you could probably come. Look at all the different candies being sold on this market. Let's continue on walking. You could get yourself some fresh coconut to drink, some orange juice. You could see it being squeezed out right here. Wow, look at all this stuff. This looks very, very nice. I'm gonna set the camera at 0.5 so we can get the vibes of this whole place. Everybody's eating a bit of food right now. Very nice, enjoying their evening meal. Wow, some mango, some prawns. Wow, this is really tasty. Now this is Evelina's favorite food, the scorpion. You have the scorpion, you got all sorts of cockroaches, anything you would like. Whoa, smell it. I smell the cockroaches already. There's this uh, different smell to all those cockroaches and scorpions being cooked. They smell different from ordinary normal food that we are used to. Oh, Evelina found some place where they're making some dish with eggs. There's one more down there. I don't even know what this is. Just some egg with something. Evelina has already found some candy. Some nice sweet stuff that she probably wants. Nope, looks like she doesn't want it. So let's keep on walking in the night market to see what they got here. Some, wow, look at all the food here in Thailand you never get used to the food because there's so much of different food it's not like Turkey where you have a kebab and a kebab here it's everything is different like dumplings different fruits for sale wow there's a lot a lot of people here tons I mean look at this so many of them here Wow, different livers meats see being cooked right here I have no idea how they cook food at this heat because it's already really hot it's like 30 degrees right now and they're cooking on fire and gas and it gets even hotter you really have to be used to the heat to be able to work under such harsh conditions where it is absolutely boiling hot so eating more food wow so much stuff seems like we guys are doing some sort of an investigation into the Thai's night markets. What do they have here? Today we're going to find out. On the other side is I did not find myself any slides. So I guess I'll be damaging my legs for another day. Probably find some tomorrow because today we had to get our face IDs done and then we're just figuring out what we're going to do. I don't even know. So this is uh, Hopefully tomorrow at least we can plan out our day and record a decent video doing something for you guys and also some updates on what is going on in Russia because I know you guys want to hear my opinions and my feelings and I got a lot to tell you guys, a lot and a lot. Holy smokes, look at the people enjoying so much food right here. They were having an absolute feast right now. That was huge. Wow. All sorts of different sushis behind those people as well. I'm gonna try to record. You can see there's tons of 
different of sushis of all kinds. So as you guys know, safety is the number one priority. Last time I was on a tuk tuk, standing right here, a car nearly crashed into the side I was standing. So yeah, it's a bit sketchy, but I'm literally standing on this metal piece right here. So if this breaks, I'm probably going to die. That would suck after leaving Russia. Dying on a tuk tuk. You might be looking at my face and wondering why does my face look like this when I'm in such a cool looking apartment, right? Well, it's because our whole floor smells like sewage and we got scammed because they said they're gonna remove that smell. We thought it's only in our apartment, but it's on the whole floor that we live in. And I have went up onto a higher floor today with the guys I met and I went out on their floor. It smells delicious there. Their apartment smells good. But the one in where we live smells like crap, literally. So we're gonna be figuring something out because it is very, very hard to do anything. And uh, we can't live there. It smells like crap, like literally, like human feces. So, I really want to stay in this apartment complex, but a higher floor, not the same floor as we're in right now because it's horrible. <sighs> this is just, you know, everything can't go straight. Everything can't work out the way it's supposed to. And um, I just hope that we get something sorted out already today because this is just unbelievable. This is impossible to live like this. But on the other note is we're gonna go and eat some of that soup we had yesterday and hopefully we get that apartment stuff sorted out tomorrow as well. Because we can't be living stinking up. Racing down on the Tok Tok right now over to get some soup. Hopefully we will get it because it's 11.30 right now and I really hope that lady is working right now because it's one of the best things ever. So we made it over to the best soup in Pattaya once again beside this exchange place in Jomkien. We finally made it to the soup. We're sitting in this random place right here in the parking lot. But the food is so good that, you know, we're just gonna eat it here. If you guys wanna see me eat it, just watch one of the previous episodes where I'm eating this soup. This is the best. Oh, got inside the talk talk. Now we're off. To our apartment guys i am currently amazed by the speeds of the internet in thailand it is absolutely mind-blowing i would have never saw something like that in russia 586 download 558 upload thank god that i have to go down here for a second and uh, upload a video so hopefully it's going to take literally a second i wonder how long is it going to um take upload let's see how long is it gonna take to upload a video seven minutes six minutes oh this is gonna be quick wow this internet is amazing wow guys the internet is so quick it only took five minutes of my time to actually upload the video which in russia took about like 20 minutes wow very technologically advanced and this is one heck of a place if you upload videos or do live streams or anything like that. <sighs> Tomorrow we gotta figure out what we're gonna be doing with the apartment because of the bad smell and it is just horrible sewage smell. I got a message from one of the guys who is a realtor who said he's able to show me an apartment at four. So let's hope that we're gonna be able to uh, tell the people who we rented from that we're not, hold on my face. So we're not going to be renting from them and we're going to be moving to another apartment on another floor which doesn't smell like crap <sighs> i guess this is what you get when you move so what can i say what can i say thank you very much for watching this video guys really appreciate you guys watching really appreciate the subscriptions the likes the comments really truly appreciate it everybody have an amazing flipping day today. I'll see you in the next video.